Yeah. Cause I let you know. So I had a great Bully Cole Part 10. I know I said I wasn't gonna do it, but I'ma do it anyways. I ain't gonna probably get into as much details I originally was gonna do, but I'll just go ahead and speak on it. So, um, at what point um, have our dogs gone too far? You know what I mean? At what point does American bully, you know, become a bulldog? At what point? Um, I've seen a lot of more pushed in faces and, and a lot more uh, bulldog characteristics. And I don't know if it's from, from, from inbreeding, from the bulldog. Dog that was already mixed in there, like everybody knows, you know, that we got we done had some bulldog mixed in down the line, and you know, about, about, shit, seen about 15 years ago, everybody know the bulldog was mixed in, you know, and uh, you know, you know that it's always been on the down low, people talk about it off the record, you know what I'm saying? Well, I'm gonna let y'all know, shit, I said, what it is. So I don't know if the bulldog is coming out because you know, people lining up the pedigrees and they breeding, they, they breeding it up, they lining it up and it's just coming back out or the people directly breeding to these animals and hanging papers and lying to the public you know i don't know which one y'all are doing out there but it's not it's not cool um, and i was always on trying to unite us and to stick together because of the breed and all that but you know what it ain't gonna happen it's not gonna happen like that because too many people out here in it for themselves and not the dog so uh, ain't no more, ain't gonna be no unity. There ain't gonna be no unity because people don't wanna get together, there ain't gonna be no unity. Motherfuckers wanna do their own thing when it comes to these dogs. Uh, and, and the community itself is, is divided as a whole. You got people hating on, on this on this bloodline and that bloodline and you know. Yeah, Mark Mark rocked the uh, Fearless Gotti Line camp. You know, I got I rocked the Gotti Line name, but I still fuck with Razor's Edge. I got Razor's Edge dogs on my yard right now, 100. percent I'm not knocking that. I'm not knocking Razor's Edge. I fuck with Razor's Edge. So a lot of people out here just hating, man. Get over the shit, homie. Let's, let's keep it about the about, about the dogs, man. Let's get in the in these rings if y'all show. Y'all that's, that's real breeders and, and real kennels and keep doing what y'all do. These, these fads and these, these dudes out here just thinking they're going to get rich and buy some dogs up and get rich quick. It ain't going to happen. And they going to see that. It's a long hustle. And if you do ever make some money, by the time you make it back, you're going to feel like you owe that because um, all the hard work and time you put into it and the money you put into it. You know what I'm saying? All the, all the Every day you're going out there cleaning up dog shit, walking these dogs, training them, uh, giving them their medicines for the ones that need it, vaccinating them, deworming them, you feel me? Uh, taking them to shows, promoting, and, and then when you got to deal with litters, deal with the puppies every day, and deal with the mama every day, and whoop, 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 and that's a whole another job and a whole another chapter within itself, and you got all this stuff going on, and people can't just call themselves breeders because they get two dogs, that's not cool, you feel me? I'm getting off my topic, you know what I'm saying, but the point that I want to make in this video is, uh, Y'all need to think about where y'all going with this breed, man. First y'all had extreme, now you got exotic. You know what I'm saying? What's next? I mean, what's after that? You feel me? So we just gotta stick to the standards, y'all. That's why. That's why they put the shit together. Either stick to the, stick to the. Uh, if you ain't gonna stick to no standards, at least stick to the ABKC standards. If you ain't gonna stick to your, to the to the UKC standards, you feel me? And, and the standards of of a of a real man and a breeder, a real woman. And, Stick to the breeding standards and don't mix shit in. How about that? How about not mixing shit up? And if you do, put it out there. My boy Benzo, he got a hot ass breeding right now. His phone ringing off the hood. You know what I'm saying? He putting it out there. He ain't lying and deceiving. It. And I can respect that and I appreciate that. And, and more people need to stop um, lying and just keep it 100. You feel me? So that way we stop this guy in everybody. So, Big more Bully Cold Part 10. I hope I covered everything. You feel me? I love to see what my comments is talking about. So, uh, comment, rate, subscribe. You feel me? And, uh, Shouts out to everybody out there that, that that's uh that's with this movement and, and, and we're gonna keep it 100 over here and, and that's all we can do, baby. You feel what I'm talking about? And, and let the suckers fade with the wind because we're gonna still be here holding it down. That's what we do. Yeah, that to the next one. I'm down. I barely miss a smoking session Check it out, I've been stressing And don't wanna answer questions Cause I stay loaded like a Smith and Weston Fully automatic So jackrabbit ass niggas Need to stop acting plastic Before I get the dirty Dancing with the blapper stick If you got it backwards I suggest you get it accurate